a lot of times we build a team. And the team is amazing. And that one group of people absolutely knows one another. So that 15 or that 12 is absolutely bonded super close. But what we're trying to provide is a whole village, a family. So you have a little sister, you have a big sister, you have someone who's on a different team in a different spot that you can go to for support or love or guidance or, you know, they're not on the floor with you, but that's the person who comes to watch you perform. That's what we're trying to build today. Well, today is our all team bonding. So it's a time where everyone from the program, our coaching staff and all of our athletes from when they're tinies to seniors, they come to one space. We get them together, um, we spend all day together. We do uh, team bonding activities where they uh, focus on like trust and patience with each other. They have to learn their strengths and weaknesses and how to use both. I think what's most important is they get to learn kind of their place and their space and how their strengths can complement someone else's weaknesses and, and how to communicate with other people verbally and non-verbally to get a task done. So lunch is going to be a little different. Your group has to all have the same thing. Your group has to all have enough. No one can be hungry in your group. Nobody can be without in your group. So the rules are you cannot physically touch or eat anything that is red, gold, or black. I really want the kids to be able to own this moment and own the activities that they did today, um, be able to just relish in the fact that I did, I met new brothers and sisters, and for them to know that in this moment it's literally just them. Like it's not even about the coaches, like this day is literally for the athletes, it's for them to, you know, keep together and keep with themselves. Everyone, welcome to the family. We're gonna end with our new rap that we made up earlier today, okay? Okay. I want, Bailey, come stand in the middle. You're gonna count five, six, seven, eight, okay? My cheerleading is just what we do. Kids is what is important. And when you, when you're in front of a child, in any capacity, you have the power to change your own future and theirs. So, we've been very deliberate in taking time to develop programs and systems that make sure that they're okay. Because win, lose, or draw, they're still a kid. And that kid is still a person. And we have to know that.